Hey everybody, welcome back to Hocus-Pocus.com. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Today we're going to look at Rubik's Dream 360 from Henry Harrius and Vanishing Incorporated. All right, Rubik's Dream 360, what is this? You might remember a while back we did a review for Rubik's Dream. Now this is Rubik's Dream 360 and as its name implies, you can show this on all six sides. That's right, all six sides, no bad angles, ultra realistic, tons of possibilities. If you already got Rubik's Dream, you might want to think of this as Rubik's Dream Bigger, Better, Brother. And the cool thing about this is you can even twist one of the sides, one complete full rotation to add that extra bit of realism. You do Rubik's Magic, you always wanted to get into Rubik's Magic, you're intrigued, you're like, what is this? Tell me more. All right, I'll tell you more. Uh, you order this, it comes to you in the mail, what are you gonna get? A nice hard shell box. Nice hard shell box. Vanishing Incorporated always has great packaging. They do, they really spend the extra time. Uh, inside that, you're gonna get a nice little padded uh, interior to protect everything they're giving you. You're gonna get the shell, obviously, it's a gimmick, it's a Rubik's shell. Inside the shell, you're getting an actual Rubik's Cube, which is awesome, you don't need to buy a Rubik's Cube, it comes with one. Uh, you're gonna get the stickers, uh, and I'll talk a little bit more about how you'll use the stickers. And you're going to get the download code. Download code will take you out to the internet and you'll have access to a video that's roughly an hour and 10 minutes long. Now, obviously, because I already had Rubik's Dream, I kind of knew what this would be because they say in the video exactly what it is. It's a Rubik's shell that you can show from all six sides. And I didn't really know how they were going to do it. I had some ideas like, oh, maybe they'll do this or that or whatever. But it was even better than what I could have thought. And uh, yeah, I think the angles on this are Perfect. I think so many times we worry about angles and what we can show to our audience. With this, perfect angles. It's totally beautiful. Um, inspectable wise, nah, I still wouldn't hand this out. All right. Even though it looks perfect, and even though you can, you know, twist one full rotation. Uh, if they took it into their own hands, they would still want to act like it was a real Rubik's Cube and they'd want to mix and solve. They can't do that. So once, it's, uh, once you have the shell in your hands, that aspect of it is not inspectable. But most of the tricks that Henry's going to teach you involve you handing the cube out beforehand. And so they should get that feeling. They should get that sense that it was inspected to begin with. How's the video? What are you going to learn? Uh, the video is well done. Vanishing Incorporated always makes great videos. Uh, everything's well shot, nice and clean, HD. Everybody's well mic'd. You don't have any annoying uh, music in the background that's distracting. It's all shot in English, except for one little snippet at the very, 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 very end. So you don't need to worry about that. Um, it's great. And as far as what they're going to teach you, obviously they're going to go over everything in the box. They're going to go over the gimmick itself and some proves so that you can prove it's normal okay uh, and then they're gonna give you 12 tricks 12 tricks uh, you're gonna learn four different paper bag uh, tricks where the uh, Rubik's Cube goes in the bag unsolved and comes out solved uh, you're gonna learn a matching cube effect where you can have your spectator shuffle the, the the cube up and then you match the colors you're gonna learn one that you can do with one hand and your eyes closed so that's pretty cool and you're gonna learn two tricks that involve the little tiny cube so you do like a shrinking cube effect. Then you're going to get four bonus routines from some of Henry's friends. Uh, these will all involve uh, silks, uh, an iPad, a stickerless uh, Rubik's Cube, and a speed solve. How's the gimmick? Is it well made? It is amazing. It's amazing. You can pull this thing out of the box straight and you're going to feel in your hands, you're going to, you're going to think that you're actually holding a real Rubik's Cube. I mean, mass-wise, it doesn't feel any heavier, it doesn't feel any bigger, it doesn't feel any bulkier, it doesn't feel fake, it feels like this is what a real Rubik's Cube feels like, it feels like the exact dimensions. And when you slide the cube out from the inside, you're going to see just how snug it is, how perfectly uh, fitting it is. You take care of this, it's going to last you forever. How much practice does this all require? Um, a lot of the tricks on here are extremely easy. I would almost say that they're self-working. Okay, they're really easy to do, not any memory work to do. Uh, Henry's going to teach you some tricks that are that you're going to be able to do immediately. Like just get a paper bag and you're going to be able to do it immediately. Uh, it's it's really awesome. It's going to I would start with some of the bag transformations and then uh, go from there and you'll be banging these out easily right away. All right. So what's the deal with the stickers? Um, stickers has to do with your initial setup. 
you're gonna have to ask yourself, how do I want my shell to look? Do I want my shell to be a solved cube or do I want my shell to be my favorite memorized mix? If you were gonna do a trick where you had two Rubik's cubes match, right? Let's say you have the spectator mix it all up and then you take a solved cube and you mix it to match, then you'd want your shell to be in the mixed formation. Otherwise, uh, you're gonna to wanna to put the stickers on in a solved formation. And I would just make sure that you get a real cube, Rubik's Cube side by side and make sure you copy them identically just so that you don't mess it up and stick one color on the wrong side. And you can only do this once. You don't want to peel these stickers up and, and do it again. So be really careful. So setup, it'll take you uh, some initial setup. You will have to put all the stickers on. Reset though, it's instantaneous. Right now, Rubik's Dream 360 sells for $155. And I think originally when I did the Rubik's Dream review, I said, go ahead and get two of these. You're going to want two of these. Uh, if you haven't already gotten two of these, you know what I would do? I would just get this one too. Uh, so get Rubik's Stream and then also get Rubik's Stream 360. You'll have two gimmicks, both of them versatile, both of them able to do different things. Uh, and you'll have just a, a wealth, a wealth of magic tricks that you can do between the two. Uh, this is amazing. Uh, it's really upping the game. Henry Harris has once again knocked down a wall in uh, Rubik's Magic, and I'm excited to see what he does next. All right, so that's everything I can say about the Rubik's Dream 360 Henry Harris Vanishing Incorporated. You're here at hocus-pocus.com. We want you to keep uh, searching around, scroll around, add some more things to cart. If you have any questions about these tricks, please don't hesitate to email us. We want to be your one-stop shop for all of your magic needs. Thanks, and I'll see you guys next time. Time. Bye.